Hi guys. Welcome back to Tenorshare channel. Whether you just switched from Android to iPhone or you're planning on it. The big question to ask is how you transfer data from one device to another. Going from an Android phone to another is one thing. Going from Android to iPhone is a whole different beast. Next are two reliable methods I found, you can choose according to your needs. Way 1. Move to iOS. Things to note with this method include the following. 1. Factory reset your iPhone device. 2. Download move to iOS on your Android. 3. Maintain sufficient power and stable network. On your iPhone's active process. Go to data transfer screen, tap move data from Android. On your iPhone, tap continue and a 6 or 10 digit code will appear. Open Move to iOS on your Android. Then go to Open Find Your Code page. And enter the displayed code on your Android. Wait until the transfer data screen appears. Then choose the content you want to transfer then tap Continue. Even if your Android signals completion. Wait until the loading bar on your iPhone finishes as the process duration depends on the amount of your data. But, if you don't want to factory reset your iPhone, if you want to retain the original data on your iPhone, then the next solution is more suitable for you. Way 2. Transfer data from Android to iPhone with iTrans Go. iTrans Go excels in efficient data transfers, versatile backups, and software stability. It supports up to huge amounts of data in no time and works without relying on mobile networks with fewer issues. Free download link in the description below for your hassle-free data transfer. Let's see how it works. Just connect both phones to your computer. Download and open iTrans Go. Go to the Android to iOS section and click Start. Follow the prompts to enable USB debugging on your Android phone. Then install the Connect app. After choosing your preferred data, click the Start Scan option, and then the Transfer Data option. Watch as your data seamlessly moves from Android to iPhone. With three simple steps your data will be transferred, it is practical and efficient. For a small number of files, you can just transfer through email or message apps like WhatsApp, which you may have already done before. So guys, that's all for today's video. Subscribe us to get more skills. Thanks for watching. Have nice day. See you.